after logging into your Mailgun account, go to the Sending tab in the left navigation menu. And here you have the option of adding new domain. If you click on add new domain, you can write down your root domain or subdomain, any domain. And then select the region and then click add domain. And your domain will be added in the list. So I have already added the domain. Click on the domain name. And on the next page, you will see SPF, DKIM, MX and CNAME records. So we will add all these records one by one to our DNS provider. My DNS provider is Cloudflare, but you can add these records to any DNS provider you use. So for adding the SPF record, you have to make sure that your DNS provider doesn't have an existing SPF because you cannot add more than one SPF records. If you do, one of them will fail to work and it will cause conflicts. So I have an SPF already added to my DNS provider. Let me show you. I go to my DNS provider, click on my website, go to the DNS tab. Now go to records. And here we have the list of all records. And here is an SPF already added. So in this situation, we use an SPF merge tool to combine multiple SPF records into one. So you, how you can use this tool, you just write down your domain name here and then write the Mailgun SPF record. So we copy it and paste it into this field and now click submit. And here this tool detects your existing SPF record, merges it with Mailgun SPF and gives you a merged value which contains both record values. Now you can add this merge value to your DNS provider and the both records will work fine. Select the type. Now we copy the record name or host name. Add it in the name field. I will write down my subdomain because I added a subdomain. Now you copy the merge value and add it here. Now click save. SPF is now added. We move towards the DKIM record. Click add record. Select type. DKIM is also a TXT record. So we select txt, now add the record name, now copy the value, add it in the content field and click the save button. Next are the receiving records which are MX records. Now you have to make sure that your DNS provider doesn't have MX records already added. If they do, you do not have to add these MX records. In fact, you must not add multiple MX records because these are the receiving records and uh, your emails will be going to these servers. If you add multiple receiving servers, it may cause confusion for the servers to where to deliver your emails. That is why we only add MX records from one source. My DNS provider has MX records already added, so I will not add these records. But if you do not have MX records, you can add and you should add these MX records. Moving on to the tracking records, this is a CNM record. So tracking records are used to keep a track of your email clicks and how many emails got opened and how many people unsubscribed the emails. So these are important for tracking the progress. Write down the record name and value and turn off proxy. We turn off proxy for every CNAME record because when proxy is enabled, it diverts the traffic to the Cloudflare server instead of going to the email server, which can cause verification issues. Now we have added all records. Scroll up and click on verified DNS settings. So here 
all records are verified except DKIM. You have to activate it manually. Click the gear icon, click activate, and now click refresh. Go back to the domains tab, and here all the records are verified. The green check mark with your domain indicates that the domain is now authenticated. Although Mailgun doesn't provide a DMARC record, but adding DMARC is very important to build trust with the mailbox service providers like Google, Yahoo, Outlook. So you can generate a DMARC value with dmarcdkim.com domain check tool. In the tools section, click on check domain. Now write down your domain name. Click the check button. And here you have a suggested value. Now we will add this DNS record to our DNS provider. DMARC is always a TXT record, so select the type TXT. Now write down the record name. Now copy the suggested value, add it in the content field, and click the save button. Now we have added all the records for our sending domain and now emails have a significantly high chance of being delivered to our customers inboxes instead of ending up in the spam folder. If you do not see your domain authenticated right after adding the DNS records, it means there is a misconfiguration in your DNS setup. If you are unable to figure out where the issue is, you can either contact Mailgun support team or you can hire a dmarkdkm.com expert. Go to the link in the description to schedule a meeting with one of our experts. So guys, that was it for today. I hope this video helped you. If it did, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe the channel to stay updated. I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care and have a good day.